and God is gone and the devil takes hold who will have mercy on your soul Your soul haunted. I am death, none shall excel. I open the door to heaven or hell. covers this week is a special edition because it's Halloween my favorite time of the year and I thought I would do something a little bit different for that reason um, I'm still gonna talk to you now about why I chose the cover and what I did with it but I thought I'd put some footage over this of me actually doing the makeup look for this week as I went all out with a whole Grim Reaper look it took me about three to four hours to do which is a lot longer than it should have done but I cheaped out on face paint so the black it took about six coats of the of the black paint to get it to actually go black. It took quite a few coats of the white paint as well. Um, surprisingly, despite how pale I am, I'm not actually that white, it turns out. But anyway, um, I thought it would be pretty cool to show some of that footage, you know, as it took me three hours to do, I might as well record it and get something else out of it. And I thought it was quite cool to look at the process as well. I don't usually, I don't do any tutorials or anything like that. And this isn't really a tutorial, it's just me showing you how I put the makeup on. I wouldn't do a tutorial because I'm not good enough really yet to be telling anybody else how to do their makeup. I kind of made this up as I was going along in case you can't tell from the fact that now I am doing my eyebrows after already starting to paint the face because I suddenly realized that I hadn't put anything on my eyebrows and I wasn't gonna be able to smooth them down very well without any sort of product. Anyway, as you can see, I'm not an expert at this stuff. I'm just like an amateur who absolutely loves Halloween and I did, I did go all out on the look for this week though, so. Anyway, as for the song, I had a couple in mind because I'd done a couple of covers for my cover gigs and stuff that were a bit spooky. Like, you know, I did Toxic a while back, but obviously I did that one pretty recently, a bit too soon to be repeating it really. Um, and I've been doing E.T. by Katy Perry that I'll put up at some point. But I had the idea that I wanted to dress up as the Grim Reaper and I thought it'd be quite fun to dress as the Reaper while singing about death. I was actually thinking about doing Don't Fear the Reaper as the song, but when I was listening to it all the way through, you know, it's four minutes, it's not massively lyric heavy, and it's definitely not very vocal heavy, like it's not vocally that challenging or interesting, it's more the guitar and everything else on that song that makes it what it is, and I just thought it wouldn't really work for one of my versions. I thought this song is very interesting vocally and very folky in style and very spooky naturally, so I thought it would work really well. So this song is called Oh Death, surprise, surprise, and it's by an artist called Jen Titus. You probably haven't heard it before, but if you have, you 
most likely know it from the same place I do, which is Supernatural. Um, it was used in an episode when the four horsemen were a thing and they were introducing the horsemen of death. The very first scene where we see him, this song is playing in the background. And I remember that scene being really impactful. And I remember this song specifically because it's in that scene and it just, it works so well. Um, and because of that, I really associate it with death. So I thought, you know, what better song to sing dressed as the Grim Reaper than the song that's literally the death song to me. It took a bit of Googling to find it because I didn't actually know what the title of the song was or who it was by. Um, and I was worried that I probably wasn't going to be able to find chords for it because you thought like, it was a bit of a long shot. But I tried anyway. And it turns out, of all things, I found someone had put it up for ukulele. Now, luckily, it was just chords. So, like, I could easily translate that to the guitar because it's just the same chords, just played on guitar. But someone is out there playing this song on a ukulele. A song that's literally just about death and they're playing it on a ukulele. What a world. Anyway, so originally it's got some almost vocal sounding harmony stuff on the original song that's quite low down and I tried to replicate that with my own voice. It wasn't easy because obviously it's quite low and I do know that there are some flat or not quite right notes in there but I decided to leave them in because I think it actually does add something to it. Having those slightly off notes it creates this sort of dissonance that I thought worked really well so I decided not to bother fixing it because it didn't actually seem like a problem. Other than that there's just some really basic percussion done with my guitar again and overall I kept the arrangement pretty simple because the song itself is pretty simple to begin with. I just had a lot of fun with this. I love Halloween so I had a lot of fun with this cover. I will be doing two more Halloween makeup looks for open mics this week, so if you haven't done already you should follow my Instagram so you can see that when it comes out. Links to my other socials, my Facebook, my Twitter and all that will be in the description as usual as well as my other YouTube channel. Um, so just check all that out guys and see you next week for another much more normal cover. That's all. Bye guys! Oh, dear. Won't you spare me all the another year?